Products. I'm Donald Williams. We're going to go over a couple of questions we've had in regards to uh, AAT correction glaze. Uh, the name implying that this is a glaze that it also has an ability, capability of filling as a typical glaze does. But as far as a, a non-typical glaze, it has a cutting and correction power to be able to take you know, a, a car's body panel that has the light towel mark scratches and everything, they actually remove those instead of just filling those products. The problem with the typical glaze that you run into is when you go and you fill in, a lot of times you get what they refer to as dieback. And that means all your holograms, your scratches, everything start to come back once it wears out. Now a lot of shops, a lot of detailers, a lot of people like to have that quick, nice little thing to make the car look good. If you're in a rush, this is a great product for it. It's also really good in the rush as far as just removing some of these light scratches and towel marks. So what I wanted to do is I want to draw a line here on this Jetta. This is a rental car. Now, what better way to test it than a car that gets thrashed because rental cars really don't take care of their cars that well. So we got a lot of scratches here, most likely from uh, their flog brushes that, that they use to clean up. We're going to run this over here real quick as a glaze. I'm going to move the tape line and then show the correction power of the 505. So I'm going to use this here first, where again we're going to go on a high speed and keep it low, but we're going to go on a rotary, I guess you could say, and uh, use a little bit of product to show the uh, filling power, I guess you would like to say. Still have a, light, uh, a mild correction to it because there are braces in it, but we will be able to take and really just do a fill on this. I'm going to keep it nice and low, be at 900 RPMs. Still want to make sure my pad is flat, but just run over this paint just to give it a quick loss. I'm going to go over one, two, three, four, and five. Now one of the beautiful things about it, again, is we like to show a lot of with our, not only just the, the glaze, but like our speed and everything, is the wipe down is extremely easy. So I'm going to take and I'm going to remove this so everyone can see what just a quick rundown of this looks like. See a nice quick shine. Can it fill more? Absolutely. But you can see a, a pretty well difference between the two sides. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take and I'm going to correct the other side of this a little bit slower using the same product, using the same pad, and then you can see a distinct difference between the two sides. This is, the, the ability of this is, is, it is a true all-in-one because you are using abrasives to correct paint, and then you're also taking and putting a Montan wax over this for protection. You're gonna get anywhere, depending on, on the, the conditions, anywhere from three to six months of protection. So an all-in-one implies that it's going to do pretty much everything you need it to do. So when you have an all-in-one and it has a little bit of wax in it, wax has natural filling capabilities in it. So you want to have a little, expect a little bit of fill to it. You don't need to plan on it because you can actually remove a whole lot of drink, but it will give you a nice clear shine as opposed to what's what's going on here. That's the idea of the glaze and, and the waxes. So I'm just going to do a little bit here. Not a whole lot. Just go on this other side here. I'm going to go nice and a bit slower on this. Now this is not going to give you 100% correction unless you sit on it for a long period of time. That's not the idea or concept of any type of glaze. The idea behind the glazes is a quick scratch cover up. With ours, it's a quick scratch cover up and removal. Create a high gloss, get a quick detail done. Because you gotta remember, whether you're in the body shop industry or in the detailed industry, time is money. And if you're not being efficient with your time, you're not making money. As far as a weekend warrior goes, it's a great touch up because a lot of the cars that people baby and they love a lot, and they take a lot of care with it, usually just need very light scratch removal, some towel mark removal, and create that nice, quick, lustrous shine. Also, the benefit of it is, as you can tell, a little goes a long, long way. These are non diminishing abrasives that's in here, so as long as they do not powder up and dry out, they'll continue to cut. Continue to level and creating that nice, beautiful, high luster shine. 
Now, I did not go over and do deep scratch removal with this. Again, this is a product that is intended to do a quick detail and get you in and out of a job quickly and to make your customer extremely happy. Now, if I were to have gone and done a total paint correction over this, I really wouldn't need to do much. Probably not the product you're really looking for. At this point in time, if I had done a true paint correction, gone with the compound using 501 or 502, or N502, I would have had a glass finish. So then all I would have had to do is protect it using Montan wax, or epoxy, uh, any one of our waxes, or even ready for maybe even a nitro seal. Okay, I'm just gonna run over it real quick just to get a nice even coat over it. I'm gonna take the tape off here. Put one nice little wipe down, so nice and easy. And now you'll be able to see a difference between a fill and the correction. So this side we just did a fill on. This side we actually did real paint correction. Well, a little more correction. So you get a nice shiny gloss and you removed a lot of your scratches here on this side. Heavy scratches and need a little more work. We appreciate you taking the time, stopping by, checking out this video. Hope, uh, hope that answers some of the questions everybody has. Uh, until next time, I'm Donald Williams. We appreciate you coming. Check us out. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. And uh, again, any questions, feel free to ask us questions. Uh, we can go ahead and get those answers. There's a lot of you guys that are really looking forward to uh, answering some of the questions on some of our products. That's what we want to do. We want to make sure you guys understand how the products are supposed to be used, why we have them out there, that we're not just putting out product just to fill one or two person's needs. We want to make sure everybody understands it and we want to make their job as efficient as possible. So again, thank you for checking out uh, 3D products, taking some time to check us out. I'm Don Williams, and we'll see you next time. <laughs> Oh!